The mind is like the body in that it needs to be fed. And you want to feed it good food, healthy food. This is why you start with conviction. The conviction that the mind's choices really are important. And if you've been unskillful in the past, you can learn from your mistakes so you can become more skillful in the future. These are the lessons that we draw from the Buddha's awakening. And they're meant to strengthen us. This is good food for the mind. Because whenever you're tempted to let the mind wander into areas you know are unskillful, you think of his example, all the many things that he gave up, all the many difficult things he tried, also that he got We'd have somebody in the human race who could find the way to true happiness and teach it to others. That was a very large-hearted desire, and it's something we should honor. We honor it, of course, by practicing the Dharma. It gives rise to persistence, mindfulness, concentration, all of which are even better food for the mind. Because with conviction you have an idea that this would be good, but as you actually get to work you begin to see in your actions, yes, it really is good. Even before you reach the end of the path you find there are a lot of good things along the path. Concentration in particular. You're feeding yourself with pleasure, you're feeding yourself with rapture and refreshment, which don't have to depend on things outside. You don't have to be a household plant. Well, they have to take you inside when the temperatures outside get extreme. Your happiness is resilient. You can be happy in all kinds of circumstances, because you've got a good food inside. And then with discernment you find whatever ways you're still feeding on unhealthy things, and you strip them away, strip them away. And here it's not just conviction, you really see for yourself that these things are true. That's even more strengthening for the mind. So feed the mind with good food. And stay away from the junk food that our society seems to be pouring out more and more and more all the time. That's how you stay healthy and strong.